In this video, we are going to learn about how you can basically add movies in our Unreal Engine project and in you know proper way. The first thing you need to create a project. Second, you need to create a folder like this M O B I E S and most of uh, user or Unreal Engine developers, what they do that they create any kind of like a random name a folder and they try to add uh, their movies clip. So for that, in the issue come in the once they export their game, they see that there's a no there's a no movie playing, no video clip, and lots of issue. Okay, so currently this is a default project. I didn't change anything. I just simply create a simple third person project. Okay. The second, what you do, you can open your content browser uh, from your you know, your file explorer. Then you can create a simple um, you know, a folder called movies. And instead of that, I already created you know a render movie. I just made that in Unreal Engine uh, 5, and I just make the render. So I want to use that in my this, uh, or I want to play that movie in at my this scene. So for that, what you need to do, just first of all copy that. And once you're doing, make sure that you disable your Unreal Engine or just close your Unreal Engine. Then come here, project and content, then go to your movies folder and just simply paste. Okay? And also try to use without a space name. Kind of like you can use MV1, that is movie 1, okay? Movie video 1, or you can just call something else. So I prefer you like this, not like give space between uh you know the names or the words okay once you've done just simply open your project again and then you need to do a simple setup in, the, in unreal engine there's a lots of way to play uh you know the videos but let me show you one more way also you need to do one more step like you need to go to your country browser then go to movies and here you see that there's a no movies so what you need to do right mouse then import movies and just select your content browser then go to movies and you find your movie clip just select that and click on open so what will we do it will be create now a media file source so now you can use this and it will be properly work so for play that there's a lots of ways so i'm showing you just uh, two ways the first way is uh like once you want to uh play your this clip in every time when the game is start so you can go to movies and at here you can uh, uh, select that wait for movies to complete then if you want you can add i uh, you know skippable movies i don't want so on setup movie just simply add so then like this now if you have question that bro uh, how can add our movie clip just simply this three uh, dot press and then go select movies and select that now if you have question that bro once this movie play if i want to play another movie how can i do that so you can just create simple another element so what you'll be do once this video complete it will be open the second video and once that second video play it will be the movie screen will be gone okay it's totally depends on you so i'm just playing one and now if i try to uh, simulate the game you can simulate the game simulating uh, I guess I need to use simulate game should be that work as you can see the movie the movie is playing and the sound is totally very uh, too much high because I'm using my speak you know speaker however in second way what you can do uh, let me just disable this or remove that and then this is a one way how we can you know just make that so if I show you with export like if I make that in ex project file so this time it will be work 100 percent so i'm just making an ex file you know i'm just generating so i can show you that no bro look once you export the game you'll be also see the same movie clip but also you need if you enable that boolean that wait for movie clip done so what you will do it will be uh play a full video and once the video complete and then it will be open your game or the movie screen will be gone okay so as you can see, it is making the X file. It will be not take too much time because my PC is enough powerful. And I'm doing it first time. Like you know, after installing Unreal in 5.0.3, I never export for Windows. Most of cases I export for Android. Okay, for Android platform. Okay, the, the game is ready. So now let's try. So for test our game, we need to go to movie folders, Windows, and here is our engine file, RR file. So if I go to RR file content as you can see we found a movie pack and so that there's our movie clip okay 
So that is basically the main thing. So now if I double click and um, try to play my game and just wait and it didn't play because you know why why it didn't play let me uh, show you why because before i export i delayed this stuff that's why it's gone so let me just add again and show you with this simply add and now let me first remove that uh, and also <laughs> let me do one more stuff let me add the skippable you know that button so we can skip that too save now let's export for windows this time it will be work 100 percent you know i just uh, remove uh, before export i just remove that movie clips from there so that's why the movie clips didn't show but because this time we add everything we didn't remove anything so well, we can see they have they have a movie clip and there should be a button also so windows rr as you can see it's playing and if i press on right mouse the movie can be skipped okay so that's all i hope you understand how you can add the movie clip in unreal engine 5 project next video we'll learn how you can use or with movie render cube and also we'll be learn that you know there's a issue come in unreal engine 5 that once we try to play a video the the video will not play in unreal engine instead of unreal engine so we'll be learn that how we can fix that too so thank you so much for watching guys love you all bye bye see you in the next tutorial video